go ahead and get some Judas Priest in my life. Let's go. <laughs> Let's do a little of that. Oh man, what's happening guys? Welcome back to the channel. I was just sitting here and I was like, I need to listen to some metal. I need like something heavy, you know, to listen. I don't, what I do when I record here, when I'm, I always have the list up of like what songs I've reacted to. And I try to make sure there's like a somewhat decent amount of variety. And that's not only for you guys on the channel, but that's also for me. Like, you know, sometimes I don't want to listen to the same genre over and over again. I want to like, I need to break it up a little bit. So Right now, it's it, I'm feeling a little bit metal. So let's go ahead and listen to Judas Priest. We're moving on to the next track. Uh, Sad Wings of Destiny, Dreamer, Deceiver. Go, by the way, I'm just going to say it once again. I love the artwork for this album. Let's go ahead and listen to the song. We'll talk about it after. Let's dive on in. That's nice. Go. There's that voice I'm used to. This is a really good song. Just rip into that. This is this is a good track.
Oh, that's a good solo. That's good. Let it go. Just let it go. Piano back there now? Huh. You know what? Let's let it lead into this song. Because it's called Deceiver. I mean, might as well. Is this like a multiple piece song? Why not? Sword on that note. I like that little bass fill. There you go. drums these songs had to have gone together makes sense title wise and musically okay I'm glad that we heard that going into the second song there so <laughs> listen I record songs ahead of time so People have probably mentioned it before, but uh, I do see, because I have the Wikipedia page pulled up here, that this song segues into the next song, Deceiver, uh, which obviously you hear that very much so thematically and kind of obviously by the title as well. Okay, what I was going to say with the first track is I came into this wanting to listen to something heavy and needing some metal, and I got this really wonderful ballad, and I was like, you know what? It's not what I was expecting but I'm still nonetheless satisfied. What an incredible song. I love the range of Halford's voice in here. It almost made me think it was another band member actually <laughs> singing in the beginning, but no, it's Halford. Uh, I love how in the beginning it's soft, low vocals, different from what we're kind of typically hearing with Judas Priest and Halford. 
But then as it goes on, the guitar solo was great by Tipton, like absolutely wonderful. Some piano even comes in uh, in the back at certain moments. I mean, that was a really, really great solo. Not I don't I want to like enunciate that it was a really good solo. And I love how long it goes on. Very fulfilling. And then when it leads into Deceiver, the second track there, that's when they let it, let it go. That's when they let the horses out of the barn and that's where they're clicking and going. <laughs> they're chasing that apple. That's when you get that <clears throat> there. And everyone goes full speed ahead there. I love how the lyrics relate with one another. We're going to kind of look into this because there's definitely a story of some sort going on, meeting this mystical figure and such. Uh, but let's let's dive into that. This was a really, really great twofer. And I was kind of confused because when we transfer, when we let it transition to the next song with Deceiver, I saw in the track listing there's another song called Prelude coming up. So I was like, uh, am I supposed to be listening to multiple um, at the same time? But I don't believe so. This this ends side A of the album. So next time we listen to Judas Priest with this album, we'll probably let the next two go together because it's Prelude and then Tyrant. So I'm I'm imagining those two go together, and plus Prelude is only two minutes long, so it just kind of. Just kind of makes sense. Let me get you guys up here with this. Standing by my window, breathing summer breeze, saw a figure floating neath the willow tree. Asked us if we were happy, said we didn't know. Took us by the hands and up we go. <laughs> hey, I was told not to take candy from strangers, but we're going up anywhere. We followed the dreamer through the purple hazy clouds. He could control our sense of time. We thought we were lost, but no matter how we tried, everyone was in peace of mind. Pretty good then, pretty good. This is definitely the, the dreamer aspect of the deceiver. <laughs> we felt the sensations drift inside our frames, finding complete contentment there. Just all the, or end all the tensions that hurt us in the past just seemed to vanish into thin air. He said in the cosmos is a sin- single sonic sound that is vibrating constantly. What is that called? There, th- what is that called? There's like um, like a universal sound or something that, uh, what, I, I can't remember what it's called, but I, I know what I, I th- he's talking about basically. Uh, and if we could grip and hold onto the note, we could see our minds were free. Oh, they're free. Ah, uh, we're lost above, floating way up high. If you think you can find a way, you can surely try. So maybe they're floating up a little bit too high. Maybe they're going too, too far down. Solar winds are blowing, neutron star controlling, all is lost, doomed and tossed at what cost forever. I like how not only does the obvious tone of the music change, but the lyrics have definitely changed now. <laughs> Meteors fly all around me, comets die, and then they, and then they. You want to see how they try to surround me? I can say, here today, we shall stay forever. And then, the obviously, the solo rips in, and then the music comes down again, kind of referencing the opening of that other track. If you want to find us in a hurry, let me tell you, don't you worry. I can't say, here today, we shall stay forever. I think they got a little bit too high. <laughs> you, you started off with the dream. But you were thoroughly deceived. And I like how the second track is just called Deceiver. Like, reiterating the point of, yeah, dude, don't trust strangers with candy. Anyways, let me know what you guys thought of the tracks in the comments down below. You can follow me over on Twitter, support the channel, and what I do on Patreon. Thank you so much for being here. Hope you enjoy the music. Hope you come back tomorrow. And I'll talk to you all then, guys. Bye.